It's Lixmas Day 7, and as a friendly reminder, it's never safe to play banjo after you've had a little too much eggnog. Today's lick comes from Max Allard once again, and by the way, if you haven't already checked out his absolutely fantastic release, Rooster, check it out. It's really great. It's got some wonderful solo banjo composition on there. It's even got a tribute to Moondog. Who doesn't love Moondog? Max's lick is really interesting. It's mostly a melodic lick, and it leverages a lot of open strings, but it has an E-flat note that gives the lick its very distinct sound. Let's hear the lick again, but played slower. As soon as I heard this lick resolve to the third, I knew where I was going to put it. The iconic major third chord in Old Home Place. One last thing to keep in mind with this lick is that it can be difficult to strike a good even balance in your tone between the open strings and the fretted ones, so that's just something to keep in mind while you practice this lick slowly. Just pay attention to what kind of emphasis you're adding in your right hand. Here's Max's lick used in a kickoff to Old Home Place. <laughs> Thanks for joining me on Lixmas Day 7. Tomorrow is going to be Lixmas Day 8, but before then, be sure to check out all the other Banjo Players videos out today on this same lick. Please check them out. They're doing some really cool stuff. And if you like what I'm doing, consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching, and I hope I'll see you tomorrow for Lixmas Day 8.